Today I'm going to show you how to use floorplanner.com to create your tiny house. First thing you need to do is log in. Um, you'll need to create an account with your email and password. Make sure you write this down so that you'll be able to get back into it. Once you have an account, you are going to be taken to a dashboard that looks like this. Right here it'll say create a new project. You're going to click that. It's going to ask you how many floors you want and what you want to name your project. So fill in all that and then you click on create project. I'm going to go ahead and go to my tiny house. It'll take a minute to load. And there you will see my example. But to show you what you will have, you'll have a blank slate that looks like this. You're going to go to construction, you're going to go to draw a room. Make this room the size of your tiny house. It can't be over 500 square feet. Drag that out, click to double check your square footage, click inside. I'm at 584, so I'm going to go to a wall and I'm going to bring that in. Now keep adjusting until I have what I need. Now if you want to add another room, you go back to draw a room and you have to start from a corner and you pull that out. If you want to change the thickness of your walls, you double click and you bring it down to five inches. That's what interior walls normally are. You can add doors and windows by clicking on this symbol. I'm going to add a window and I'm going to add a door. You can change the flooring by double clicking. You can have linoleum or a hardwood floor. You can change the color right here to what you want. And then you can start having fun by putting in design elements. And when you don't like something, you just go to the delete and take it away. When you want to see your design in 3D, you go to 3D. And there you go.